So this will be a short video in which I'm going to show you how you can edit your uh, menu, this menu right here. So let's go to appearance and then go to menus. As you can see here we have six items, but here we have only five. The first reason for this is because for some reason here we have Simera online two times and I'm going to delete one of the two Simeras. So let's remove it. And the second thing I want to say is that you can't edit this menu from this menu right here. In order to be able to edit it, first you have to create this menu. It doesn't exist yet. The menu that you see here is a menu that that is automatically generated by, by WordPress. So let's hit create menu button here. And if you want to use this menu as the menu that is used, used right here, you have to go to manage locations. And this is the primary menu for your website. You have to select it from here and then click save changes. As you can see, we all also have a tick right here, primary menu, so you can also use this tick instead of going here. Now, if we refresh, there will, there will be no change in this menu here because it was ordered, ordered the same way. But if you rearrange this menu, you will see the difference. In order to rearrange the menu, you simply drag and drop. So let's put Simera download to be the last uh, item in the menu and save it. And let's refresh, there, perfect. Now I will show you a few other things about the menu here. I will move Simera menu back here. If you want, you can make drop down menus and you can do this by moving the menu a little bit to the right. As you can see, it moves to the left and to the right. If you place it right here, this will be a sub item to this menu right here. You can even make them all submenus of one another. Let's save the menu and I will show you what this actually looks like. So let's refresh. And as you can see here, we have only one item now. But if you mouse over here, you get the Simera download, then you get the Simera for PC, then you get, then you get all the rest uh, items. So this is how you can structure your menu if you want to do something like this but we are not going to do something like this for now. I'm going to fix it. Maybe we can move the Simera Para PC under the Simera 4 PC and the same with the Simera download and then move this right here. Let's save it and refresh. So here we have the uh, other language pages under the English language pages. All right. This is totally up to you. It all, it all depends on how you want to structure your website. But in general, I would do it this way. And I would place these pages in the menu itself if we had, if we had the space to do so. So I did it like this because we are going to add another thing to this menu right here. And I will show you how you can add a category to the menu. It's very easy. You simply have to go right here, click on categories and select the category that you want to add to your menu like this. There it is. You can do the same by adding posts. When you have more than uh, one post, you will have all your posts here. Actually, you will have all your posts in the view all tab here and you can use them and add them to the menu. Let's save the menu. And now we have our category right here, like this. We will have all posts that are in this, in this category right here. I will rename this category really fast because test posts means nothing for us. I will rename it to photo editors, update category. All right, let's go again, perfect. And I will show you why I did this a, a little bit later. Now, we can take this Kagar Simera out of here because we have the space. Let's go menus and take it out. Perfect. 
Uh, we don't have space for the Simera Para PC and if we take it out, it will become really, really ugly. Like this, it will become on two rows and we don't really want to do this. So I will move it back here and we're done for now. See you in the next video.